If you're a fan of the Fox Show Empire, you definitely want to go to a local talent show. It's taking place in Dayton this weekend. Rhonda Moore joins us now with who you can expect to see perform. Good morning. Right now we have two rappers and they are going to perform at the talent show and their names are King Jala and also Lucian and they are seniors at Ponis High School. Joining me now is Tommy Owens and he is the organizer of the Family Affair talent show. All right, you guys have been doing this for 10 years strong. Ten years, Ron. It's been crazy. And we appreciate you being with us all ten years. It's been phenomenal. I'm so excited. I'm getting goosebumps right now. We've been able to uh, put about 1,200 kids on our talent show over the last ten years and serve about 25,000 families to come out and watch us. It's exciting. Ten years, and it's going to be not one letdown this year. I'm super excited. We have 32 acts this year. What kind of things are we going to see besides rappers? You're going to see the rappers. You're going to see the singers, you're going to see the dancers, poetry, it's going to be crazy. We also got Tiana from Empire, young lady from Empire is coming to host it. So this is going to be bananas. And we invite everybody out, it's a family affair. And the categories are divided between elementary and middle school kids and then high school kids. So they don't all compete with each other, right? Correct. All right, well, I've been a part of this, as you said, for 10 years. I've been one of the judges. I'll be a judge again this year. And it's always a lot of talent. So if you want to come out to the Family Affair Talent Show, it is Saturday at Ponis High School in Dayton. Elementary and middle school students will perform at 3 and the high schoolers at 8 p.m. And we'll be back at 8.05 and we're going to have some more performers for you to see. Back to you guys. Thanks, Rhonda. Dozens of students competing in annual talent show right here in the Miami Valley this weekend. As Rhonda Moore shows us, some special guests are stopping by. Good morning. There are going to be 32 acts in the talent show, including some special guests. And this group is called Wildflower. I'm busy trying to be around you. Trying to be around you. Joining me now is Tommy Owens, and he is the organizer of the talent show. All right, tell me about these girls here. These young ladies are called Wildflower. They started off on our talent show. They've been with us about four years. We actually put them together to compete. Now tell me about the talent show as far as the different categories that the uh, students will compete in. They'll be competing in rap, dance, uh, poetry, and um, singing. We have some great vocalists, great talent that comes from Dayton. I'm very proud of what's going on. Again, it's our 10th anniversary. We're trying to show them Dayton really does have talent. And then what will they win? Um, everybody's a winner. So everybody wins medallions, they have t-shirts, and they got uh, bragging rights, trophies. Then also, two of the people that win in the rap and singing, they'll be featured on the radio station. So um, we're, we're pretty excited. And we have Chris Pearson, the boxing champ from Dayton, Ohio. He's one of the judges. Keith Harrison, one of our Grammy Award winners. And again, Tiana from Empire is coming to host. So it's going to be a star full field night. You left me out. Come on, we can't leave you out. <laughs> I'm Ms. just Rhonda <laughs> Moore, we truly appreciate everything you've done for us the last 10 years. You showed your commitment to us, not only us, our community and our young people. Thank you. Well, if you want to come and check out the Family Affair Talent Show, it is Saturday at Ponis High School in Dayton. The elementary and middle school students will perform at 3 o'clock, and the high school students will compete at 8 p.m. And we'll be back at 8.50, and we're going to hear from another singer. Back to you guys. Thanks, Rhonda. Dancers, rappers, and singers will show off their talents. They'll perform at a family-friendly talent show. Rhonda Moore is with one of the singers who's competing. Rhonda. Good morning. It's the 10th year for the Family Affair Talent Show, but it's the first time that Tyler Brown has participated. Now, Tyler is a seventh grader at Ankeny Middle School in Beaver Creek. Joining me now is Marlon Shackerford, and he is one of the organizers of the talent show. Every year, you guys amaze me with how much talent you have from these young kids. Oh, we're very talented, especially in the Montgomery County. People don't know we're the city of funk, we're the city of aviation, and we're the city of peace. 
Why did you guys come up with this idea in the first place? Well, the biggest reason is a drug-free summer. And we, we really call it a life show or edutainment, education via entertainment. We want to make sure that these young people raise the bars academically, too. And we're expecting you to be great, not just in a talent show, but in life and in our community. It's not easy to be in a talent show. You have to be one of the best. I think we had over 150 tried out, and I think we have 32 acts. We give you something to do, especially the kids that are part of the talent show, for two and a half months. So four, they can become drug-free, crime-free, hate-free, and violence-free. All right, sounds good. Well, if you want to come to the Family Affair Talent Show, it is Saturday at Ponies High School in Dayton. Now, the elementary and middle school kids will perform at 3 and high schoolers at 8 p.m. And you'll see talent like Tyler here. And again, 32 acts. Back to you guys.